Transformers Italia and today I will show you the uh, Wei Jiang M01D Battle Damages uh, this is the oversized knockoff of the Age of, Age of Extinction um, Evasion Optimus Prime that means that he had the Halt mode of the G1, classic G1 Prime, and the robot mode of the movie of the movie Prime, and so on. Uh, this it the this item have a custom paint, some bottle damages paint, um, and it is pretty pretty heavy, you know. Uh, all the cabs is in metal, this side is metal, and also this side is metal. And so this is a, uh, oh, sorry, this is a two pair, uh, so a double oversized knockoff. But uh, I think that is uh, pretty reductive to call it uh, some just a knockoff because there is oversized and they add to the mold a lot of. Uh, particulars and improve a lot this this one so it's just like one improvement improved mold of the age of extinction um, mold of evasion mode optimus prime so on as you see uh, there is some battle damages paint up it just like it is a mass production custom because they add a lot of paint apps, uh, a lot of uh, as you can see a lot of uh, silver in this side, uh, here we had uh, we have some uh, gun metal feet and uh, bronze uh, scratches. Uh, the paint is very good, as you can see now. I can scratch and doesn't chip. Uh, I also try with a screwdriver and the the paint job doesn't chip, so they do really really a uh, good job. Uh, this sample is just one pre-production sample. Uh, the final uh, products will be in uh, four thousand copies, and each one should have one. Uh, should should have the uh, his number so each collector can have a um, a numbered copy and if you buy if you if you buy two of of it uh, you can uh, you can have also a slight difference slightly slight difference maybe you can have also a slight difference over the pin the pin the pin apps because each one is handmade uh, custom so uh, they do a really really good job uh, as I told you before this one is metal so it's pretty heavy pretty big uh, for example they have some rubber ties so it's really really high quality uh, toys um, so let's see the um, transformation for transform it you have to remove this this side tank and um, you can start to transform it in this gun so just to open it um, close this one open here rotate here for a custom for a um, for some uh, gun details also over here you can rotate here and connect them so here is the gun I really I don't like it. It's it's just the same of the um, Age of Distinction mold, but as you can see in the back, there is a lot of accessories and it's pretty fantastic. So we can leave this one from from this side and so on. So let's start. We can start from the cap transformation. You have to first of all, you have to. It's pretty simple to rotate these pieces up. So don't worry because the the pin don't ships. Um, and you have to also to open, splitten up this this section over here. So just to don't don't don't, don't be afraid to to use force because the paint don't ship, doesn't chips. So over here, also over here, this one is a pretty uh, hard or my simple. Uh, maybe you can have to rotate a little bit the tires. And also here so now uh, there is a tab over here and over here and it's um, not the standard tab but it's just like a look at I suppose to say that look at tab and you can 
you, you need just to push it inside and try to remove the I'm sorry yeah to remove the um, the tab okay one go and now let's work on this side Here we go. <coughs> Got it. And also on the side. Okay. So now just to. Oh, yeah. There is two wings. Oh, maybe we can now start to open up the camera. Here we go. These two wings. Maybe you can rotate over here and you have to. Rotate up on this side, and if you want, you can just rotate the fake uh, smoke stud in this direction on the back. So now we can. You have to split this side. This is a one um, art that we can do to this model because the original one. Uh, the age of the extinction don't have this these two panels so you have to untap from from here and now you can just open this panel on the hub over here also this one here we go uh, and slightly open also this side and this side now slightly peel off the hands and the arm also on this side and now you have to be a little bit gentle because you have to uh, take in line the the head and rotate the shoulder uh, joint that this is on the back of this panel so I'll tell you uh, the pen apps won't ship so uh, maybe in the side we can, it could be helpful to rotate this panel in this way and taking off the head and, uh, and now slide so slide this side Maybe you can a little bit tilt this part and take off the hand. Here we go. Now you can okay, pay attention to this panel. Now we can rotate all the side, all the side panel in this way. Just a moment. This way and we can we got the the harms so let's do the same operation on this side and rotate over here pay a little bit of tension to the panel as before and here we go the other harms so Hans now um, now you can strike the arms, rotate the hand close as a fist, and you have to close this panel and tab this one over here with this double joint. There is a double joint. Uh, mechanism and you can tab over here and close the small stun gun also on this side you have to rotate the shoulder the arm close to here open up this panel and close the small stun so here we go as this as before open the hand and this so on guys, we are almost done, rotate the head and 
now there is this panel and you have to close it in this way this one the same closing this way and now you can start to open up this side there is a tab inside and here there is so you need to untab this tab and so on just rotate it this pan hover here should go inside this hole now could help open this flap that you should be the wing of Optimus Prime and close this tab over here now you can use the look at tabs for the caps just to uh, fix the um, this upper side to the the shoulder and from the main body maybe you can start to uh, rotate the waist and now just to close it close it close it and we go the full chest of the of Optimus so for the leg leg is much more simple just to split an half here and now you have to rotate this wheel and you have to push the, the inside tab to this hole so you have to close this one and so oops sorry again today the plane won't be stable so on here we go now you have to rotate ask you the fit oh no you have to close this panel so open up and close it in this way and now easy you have to rotate the feet sometime maybe this side could uh, be you have to apply a little bit of force don't rotate uh, enough but just to push a little bit in in the upper way so the the shin could, could rotate correctly and after this you have to over here okay and rotate the feet here we go also for this leg just to untap the tire wheel and push it in the hole this way untap the these pieces and close to the wheels and also you can start to rotate the feet here we go and rotate the feet so up now and now we have the Weijang M01 just a moment in his robot mode let's move the camera just a moment oops so sorry and we have he is in his robot mode just do one moment i can show you all okay. so guys um this is uh what to say it is uh really just a little focus it is amazing it's incredibly oh they can improve this mold i really enjoy to have the original one the the asbro one uh they had a lot of uh, a lot of particular to improve the joint uh, for example just to look the joint is they got the um, uh, neck the head can rotate and go up and down uh, as I told you before they add this also this side panel uh, and it can rotate they he have the he had sorry the um, shoulder joint uh you can split 
the panel in order to obtain all, all the movement and after you can close it again uh, as you can see here there is a lot of racket joint uh, so we have a standard uh, elbow joint uh, waist uh, wrist, wrist, wrist joint. Uh, the hand don't have any uh, articulated finger, but there is two points of articulation and the inch, you can move the inch as you want. Uh, we got the waist articulation. Um, you, have, you can to open a little bit the wheels, the waist wheels, in order to obtain better uh, possibility. Uh, if you want increase a lot, you can also split up these wheels and rotate on this side in this position so you can um, have a look much more uh, G1-ish with the two wheels on the lower leg that in on the upper leg and so on we have the, the knee joint, the racket joint, uh, ankle and fit so it's extremely possibility but uh, guys the main thing of this one is the the big things of this one is the paint job it's incredible it's just like a statue you can uh, i don't know you can put this one not in your collection in your room or on your glasses but you can uh, freely leave this one in your living room and i think that all your friends and all, all uh, And all the people that come to your home can say that, hey, wow, amazing, it's incredible, really, it's incredible. They have a lot of paint up, a lot of scratches. Uh, as you can see, I transform it now in front of you. I just done this transforming operation just five or six times. And uh, the, the, the custom paint won't ship. Uh, and this one is just... Uh, pre sample production is not the final. Uh, I talked with Wei Junk and told to me that the, um, the final release will be also better of this one. So uh, I suppose there is should be a better paint job or maybe some a thin prote protective layer. Uh, just one, I, I can say just one problem is that this side they do some on this side they do some uh, custom paint over the uh, chrome uh, piece of plastics so i don't know if you can see but i uh, just my my paint just chip on this side just over here and i report to to, to the wajan guys this problem and they assure to me that they will try to fix it maybe doing again this piece is not in chrome parts but in um, in our dark uh, plastics. So uh, if you open here, there is the oops, the matrix box, as you can see the matrix. And yeah, you retain all the gimmicks of the edge of the extinction mold. Uh, if you don't like the, um, the gun, you can split it up into pieces, rotate over here, and you can add or here as transformation or on the back in this hole really um i don't like any of this configuration so i think that this one will be in the in these boxes so other accessories is the he came he came with a new face without the mount plate so you can swap freely just to remove the screw that is on the back of his head and um, but guys the main thing is the weapon i really love this is the knife just like the one of the um, not on the on the raft but uh, not on the uh return of the funnel but it came from i think from the um, uh movie optimus prime uh there is a tab inside you can put firmly the the weapon in this way and close it also in this way, uh, also on this head, you can open up, insert the, the blade, and close it. So I want to show you a lot, this is a lot of uh, possibilities, so maybe we will try to have some uh, 
I don't know, so um, plastic poles just to open up, close it. That's pretty. And here we go. Maybe. Oh, not the best pose, but just to show you. So, guys, the blade, the weapon is incredible. Uh, really, I prefer. Uh, this one in clear plastics, but they add also the battle damages also on the plastic, and so you can see that it's not completely clear, but it's uh, much more darker. Uh, so on, but I think that the best thing is not the blade, but the blades, but the the axe and the shield. Just a moment. Here we go. With the shield. The shield is completely painted in gun metal with some rusty. Uh, paint hubs and also on the back side so it's completely painted and it's guess it's huge but the best thing is the X the X is incredible I really love so you see some Cybertronian uh, glyphs uh, we have some our metal uh, silver metal sketches uh, and it's huge I really I really like this this axis this axe so on uh, also the shield have his tabs over here so you can firmly connect to the to the hands yes let take it and so on. better poses better pose and so you can just to insert the shield inside plug the plug the and close so he got his gigantic gigantic shields and after you can add the access unfortunately the access don't have the tab so you are just to work a little bit to find but here a good grasp so but you have just to work a little bit to find the your, the bat better position now I was lucky because <laughs> ah, one shot one kill so sometime I use few minutes just to uh, find or to fix the uh, the hand and the possibility of the axis so uh, yeah so here we go just one the poses that I like I really enjoy you can find a lot of uh, my photo gallery of uh, the description of this review so you can check a lot of maybe you can check all the particular that in this video review I can I, I can show you to you I can show to you yeah okay guys you know uh, I'm Italian so uh, I'm not a, I'm not a naive native native English speaking so I'm so sorry but maybe I can mistake some word but Let's see, let's see, let's see. So on. Guys, I can just... It's really... I don't know how to say it is really amazing. Really, 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 I really... I really love it. Guys, uh, I suppose that we just do a superb job for... On over the mold, to improve a lot the original mold and to do a supreme job on the page job of course uh, the price is not so high I suppose that is between around 114 dollars so it is pretty cheap for one third party item and I really enjoy I really enjoy the, the next release the black one I suppose that I, I will buy also the black one and guys uh, if you like the movie uh, the Optimus Prime of the movie if you like the statue and the custom paint job you have to buy this one so it's really incredible and uh, I think that they do a lot of um, small things that uh, increase the say the aptness of the collector just like that each of the 4,000 of them will have the number, the card and the numbers and so on. I can think that you can freely buy also two, one of two of this one and each was, will be a little bit different of the... Um, 
of the others. So on, uh, guys. Uh, I, I I hope that you really enjoy this uh, this review, and maybe in the future I will do a lot. I will do some other review in English. But uh, now you are freely welcome to the uh, Transformer Italia fan page over Facebook and just to check what what the Italian community is do uh, over uh, what what the Italian Transformer community is does. So on, uh, let's see to the, see you to the next review.